Alrighty guys, just want to make a video on my 1978 Ford F100 two-wheel drive. Um, I found this truck <clears throat> sitting next to a gentleman's yard. It hasn't been driven since 1994, at least that's the last registered tag um, on the license plate. But uh, basically what I'm doing with it is Redoing the drivetrain, I'm building a 347 small block. Um, gonna rebuild the C6 trans that's in it already. Um, most likely we'll end up swapping the Dana 44 axle out for a nine inch, just cause they're a little bit beefier. But basically, let's see if I can <clears throat> look at the fender here. Everything's pretty clean. It's been sitting for a while, it's got a lot of surface rust, but in there, nothing's all, not a lot of flaky rust anywhere. If I had a better light here, I'd be able to show you a little bit better, but it's in very good shape, at least on this side. Unfortunately, where it was parked, it was sitting next to the person's house like this, and there's trees everywhere growing over top of it. So as you can see, I'm, I'm doing a cab corner on this side because um, this originally had a topper on it. So this whole back window was full of leaves and sticks and all sorts of other crap. So you can see the stains and everything. And basically just rotted this fender and that cab corner out, which I'm doing the cab corner work right now, getting that fixed up. And then I have to Hopefully, hopefully find a driver's side fender for this just because I'm not a fan of brand new metal just because how thin it is but this fender is roached out and I'm kind of confused on why it's just this one but as far as that goes interior's in pretty good shape minus the little bit of coming off there on the seat but the rest of it's in very good shape. Floor pans are good still. Don't have to do any any floor work in it. The bed's in decent shape. I mean, it's old wood. There's no holes or anything in the wood. Um, the only other thing is just the tailgate. So I'm going to have to... I'm hopefully just going to cut some material out and try to fix this tailgate up because I really don't want to buy another one. Because in all reality, it's just this part right here that needs redone. The rest of it, I could just sandblast and repaint. I've got new stainless hinges and chains. I'm um, gonna drill a bolt out on that side, but that's pretty much it for the bodywork on this thing. I'm not thinking about just doing a basically sand the thing down and just doing a um, single stage paint on this thing, just that gloss black like it is right now nothing too crazy <clears throat> it sits pretty good should be a good little cruiser in the summer that's what I'm excited for <clears throat> the 300 in it right now it does run but it is very hurt I'm I've got at least one cylinder that's completely down on compression and this thing has a lot of blow by and just from driving it in the shop all the oil and just just blowing out of here out of the valve cover and then I once I got it running when I first got it to the house driving it down the road it was blowing oil all over the firewall so this engine is hurt um, I'm not gonna scrap the thing I'm gonna keep it and probably go through it eventually but I just wanted um, a V8 to go in this thing just cuz I'm a fan of V8s um, and that's what I'm thinking I'm going to do with it. So, but yeah, figured I'd show you guys the project and uh, I'll probably make some more videos on this thing in the future. So stay tuned.